live right now. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Listen to that. Uh, uh, what is that? The Too Short Jeezy? Yeah, Only the Dies. Dream? Only Dies, man. Only Happy dimes. Friday to you guys. Um, Later on, we're going to be in Vegas. Yes. Big weekend. Yes, um, yes, but yes. Yeah, Happy Friday, man. So we had to play the uh, Jeezy, you know, for the vibe. So let me play the song a little bit more. Have you seen his music video? Mm. All flavors. 10 out of 10. It's Tati. <laughs> Brianna. Sienna. 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 Nah, but it, it's a good video. It's oh, a good video. For sure. One of my favorites. It's a good video. Um, but Friday, man. Uh, Monday. We got a crazy video dropping on Monday. The long anticipated. A lot of people been asking for this one. Yes, sir. The replica video where we explore the underground world of fakes in China. It's a. Uh, it's gonna be one for the books. Oh, well, you stop this first. This, uh, okay. Excuse me, no videos, no picture. No, no videos. This one right here Nothing is... Nothing like we, we've ever done. Nothing. This is a, a once in a lifetime experience because, I mean, you know, we don't go to Shanghai that often. What else we got? Oh, recently, the cause release. Did you pick up any? I couldn't. Oh, yeah. I was not trying to go to battle. That was in China, though. Did you see that video in China? Yeah, so... I've seen one, like, one small clip of it. My thing is, like... Why all the chaos? Because this is like, what, the third cause release? It's because, all right, so Uniqlo cause recently released another collaboration. Yep. But this one they're saying is the best one by far yet because it does have those actual figurines that for they sure. have made, for the sure. bricks and everything. Yeah. So it's a little bit more like identifiable. You know what I mean? Yeah. The, so it's um, more, more, more to, uh, leaning towards cause and it's cause. Uniqlo. Yeah. I say we watch this video, man. Let's do it, man. I I, I've seen crazy. glimpses of it. So let's watch the full video. All right, let's do it. Oh, man. Oh man. Oh, you see the cell phone rolling? I appreciate them oh, just sprinting. Full sprinting. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. This is crazy. You got. Oh my Yo. God. I did not see this clip this right here. Over a uh, $14 t shirt? This is crazy. And it's crazy because Uniqlo mass produces these. And they restock a lot. Yeah. Remember um, the first oh, time? Oh man. Shout out to like just the. the, the Yo, the look moms. at the man. Look at the man. Oh just, my God. <laughs> The man can, like, I'm out. This is crazy because the door, the front door to the store is not even fully open. <laughs> oh, they bit. Look at that. Little, like, animal. Look at it. Oh, he, he taking it off. He the, went on top of the, the, the mannequin, bro. Yo, he's smart. He's smart. Rich, is it this serious? Bro. Is what it this, this serious? Man? It's like, this ain't going to get you that fly. I, I don't think they're trying to look fly. I really think they're trying to... uh Make some money. I think this is their come up. StockX, they're 22 bucks right now, bro. A $7 come up? I have seen some $8 stores. $8 come up? I have seen some stores in the States where it was a little bit messy. It was a little bit messy, so I don't know. Maybe maybe you're right. Maybe the designs have a lot to do with how I know that's part of it, yeah. It was like the actual figurine and everything. But what sense. do you guys think, man? Do you guys think these warranted people acting like some hooligans I like it. for some Uniqlo t-shirt? I like it. You like it? I like it. You know, it's everybody try to come up. It's some hype. Remember the first ones? Uh, Those were like, we thought they were special and everything. I even sure. paid resale for them. Then I saw them at Uniqlo like 20 times again. Like yeah. they were restocking every single week. They definitely uh, took advantage of that. Uh, so when it comes to restock. the Uniqlo cost stuff, man, do not pay resale. They will no. restock. You just gotta just keep visiting your Uniqlo. Really quickly, Kyrie to the Lakers and Nets. They wow. are saying he has narrowed it down to those So no teams. Boston. I have learned that Kyrie Irving has given every indication to the Brooklyn Nets that that is where he wants to go. It must have been real dysfunctional over there. Oh, I don't think they like him though, bro. Oh, I, I don't feel think it. I they feel like it. him. I feel Imagine it. walking into the locker room and you just I feel it. not liked. I got to go with the Lakers only because he has chemistry with LeBron. I just hope he doesn't go to the Nets and ruin what they have. I it's kind of like how Boston. I can't see him and D'Angelo Russell. No, meshing. it's not I cannot needed. See that. It's not needed. I don't know. I, I I I like Kyrie to the Lakers, and him and LeBron back at it again, baby. What do you? I mean, what do you think? I like it. I just hope they can make Zoe. I actually like Lonzo. <sighs> Get your little squirt, Lamelo, in there too. You got ah, you got squirt. yourself a little squad. Little squirt. A little oh squirt. man. All right, guys. Um, what you guys been waiting for? We just went over um, the replica video drops Monday. Cause release. Kyrie, now we gotta get into the five sneakers Nike dropped the bull on. Mm. Nike, I'm on your ass. 
I've been paying attention. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's 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 get right into it. Let's get right into it, man. Because these these sneakers are pretty hyped. Yeah. Let's see. Only recent sneakers or they have not dropped yet. So this okay. everything is relevant. You yep. know what I mean? Let's do it. Five sneakers. Nike dropped the ball on, did not come through on. Maybe when it comes to production, colorways, just did not live up to the hype. All right. Garbage. I have to go and say, I try to like these. Tan. Yeah. Number one, the Sakai's. Sakai's, you got the Blazers, and then you got, I'm not gonna sit and act like I know what that original model is. It's like a waffle racer or something, but. When you have a video of someone cutting out yeah. back part. That main component that makes it hype, I guess. That's garbage. That's garbage. Colorways, what? Okay. Garbage. It kind of reminds me of the uh, Off-White Prestos. One exactly. One of the best designs. But you come out with an all white and the all black. Yes, colorways make a huge difference when it comes to those type of shoes. Colorways could have really took this shoe, I think, to the next level. For sure. And uh, I, I think Nike dropped the ball. I agree. I got to agree. Like, what? The green, yellow, and orange? I know, man. And then this, this one right here, the red, blue, and uh, yellow looks like a clown. Trust shoe me, man. They got good uh, 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 elements to the shoe. They got the double swoosh. They got the, uh, you know, the little elevated heel. You know, you, you like the elevated platform. Yeah. You know, and I actually like that little part where it sticks out the little tab in the back. I, I like it, you, you know? You like it? It makes the original shoe look better. I see what saying. you're saying. All but right. they did drop the ball on that one. Next sneaker up, man. I got to go and say they dropped the ball on this one because of Supreme being right now kind of like all eyes on Supreme, yes, right? Sir. They want to see what they're doing. Yes, sir. The Jordan 14. Oh, my gosh. What the? Yo. I see the inspiration on the jacket and everything. Listen. <laughs> Stop ahead, with the inspiration from the random things. What you gonna get inspired by yo, an elephant yo, or like? Yo. Rich, speaking of that reference photo, right? That inspiration photo. I've never seen that photo ever surface the internet. Exactly, it's not an iconic photo. <laughs> like there's no, they, they dug deep. Y'all came out with the dunk highs. The blazers. The blazers. The dunk lows, some classics, some true classics to the culture. The I don't care what anyone says, the, the, the Jordan 14 alone. No one's thinking about the Jordan 14 yeah. alone. Drop the ball. Drop the ball. Drop Colorways, the ball. rhinestones or little whatever pebbles, studs, horrible. All right, so this next one right here, man, I don't want to say Nike dropped the ball just yet. I wanted to get your opinion. Okay. You know what I mean? Yeah. Before we say they dropped the ball yeah. or they came through, maybe they killed it. I just wanted to get your opinion. Okay. The Giannis. Ooh. Set to release very soon. We don't know the price point yet, but obviously a very anticipated sneaker. What are your thoughts? The the Greek Freak ones, I believe they're called. Uh, these are interesting. I would put these above the Paul George look-wise. You know, they got the, the big reverse swoosh thing. Obviously, you got Travis Scott doing that. Uh, I think LeBron does it a lot on his, on his shoes. Yeah. I'm going to say these are fire. Fire? I'm going to say these are fire. I'm not going right. to go off the colorway. I like the silhouette. I like the shape. And I really like that signature big swoosh. I see what you're saying. I, I'm going to have to go and say fire as well. Yeah, I agree. I yep. like the uh, Nike swoosh, how it incorporates into the midsole shape. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's not random. Yeah. It flows. I would say these are a good pickup. The Paul George line getting kind of stale in my look, opinion. Look, 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 look. They got 50 colors. Mm -hmm. And they're not fire colors. Nah. So I'm looking forward to the Greek freaks. All right. So for the uh, Greek freaks, we are saying they did not drop the ball on these ones. Nah, 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 not at all. All right. So next sneaker up, man. I got to, you know transition this right okay every single time we have brought this sneaker up every single time 14 pairs minimum mm, i've said this you know what i'm talking I, about oh i know i know i know trust me johnny even in the last podcast at 14 pairs minimum yeah. we put these in the s tier every single hype talk we talk about these and they have now surfaced the actual photos ah, of the shattered backboard oh, three man. point O's. My gosh. Go in, Tan. First of all, that ain't Pan That's that's Vaseline. <laughs> that's how wow. that's how ugly the upgraded material that is. Right. is. That, I, I, something was off when I saw them, and it, I was it's like, it's not Pat leather. Pan leather, man. That's weird. Um, very, very, very huge disappointment because when we said 14 pairs minimum. We wanted tumbled leather, OG uh, color blocking. We wanted a OG bread color one. blocking. We, but wanted we wanted the bread, bread one. one with the orange. Basically. And then they did the. I hate when they do midsoles like that. Just let it happen on Put its own, black, right? You know what I mean? 
this shoe right here. No, no, no. I'm not talking about the yellowness. I'm saying the black. You needed a black oh, bottom. I did not even notice that. Bruh. I, I, I see what you're saying. The actual, like, there needs to be another color on, on the sole. Exactly. Oh, my gosh. I hope these are just, like, some early fakes or something like that. But these a lot are, of the sneaker vlogs. They're saying these are official these photos. Nike. Oh, my gosh. You more than dropped the ball on You damn near just ran out the game. You didn't even have the ball. Hold on, hold on. I got to, you know, think in a little yeah. bit bigger picture. Yeah, yeah. With this list, yeah, is this enough, I would say, dropping the ball for Adidas or some other brand to kind of swoop in a little bit? For sure. You think so? For sure. For sure, man. I feel like uh, Adidas, all they got to do is just, you know, retro a couple of 1.0 Ultra Boosts and uh, maybe they some- They tried maybe, already, bro. Maybe more, I was, more 7 Yeezys, 750s. I'd like to see something along you, that line. I, when nope. you said for sure, yeah. I was like, okay, cool. And then I thought about what the hell Adidas is doing right now. And then you know what came to my head? Huh. Those damn aqua socks that Yeezy's been rocking. Oh, sh I totally forgot about that. I totally and forgot. And then they just dropped another V2 black. Like that's your answer? Uh, okay, okay, okay. You okay. got the opportunity, Adidas. <laughs> Take advantage of it oh, if you guys want to swoop on Nike right now, but uh, I'm gonna go and say uh, I see what you mean. They, they, they're they, looking bad. I just don't see these being. Well, uh, they're obvious. They're not uh, what we all thought. They if were I be. had to rank these, they'd be dead last out of the three. Oh, all right, Nike, guys. On, uh, Nike dropped the ball on the three uh, If these are official photos, which a lot of people are saying are, I'm really sad. Like I really am. Yeah. Yeah. So. All right. So next sneaker Nike has dropped the ball on. Yeah. For sure. Mm hmm. The Travis Scotts, man, the Travis Scott ones. I uh, shouldn't have to buy a pair of Travis Scott ones. Uh-huh. And question. And question. And it's not only questioning because of what I have. It's questioning because of what people are saying about the ones they have bought from the sneakers app. For sure. The For inconsistency sure. of the production is what people are saying is throwing everything off. Yeah, it's making it really hard to authenticate a pair you got. Stitching that isn't in the right places on certain pairs from sneakers app. You got the back little uh uh the little emblem yeah the, the you know embedded emblem that sometimes isn't as deep as others yeah there so are like, so many you, signs if you like have a potential pair of fakes you yeah. can't even compare her nope. with the real because you don't nope. even know if the real are real exactly and then even the whole uh eighty eight percent getting uh oh my gosh getting past stock X and everything twelve percent getting declined but they were so if someone submitted a hundred pairs to stock X <sighs> was it a hundred or a thousand a hundred a hundred eighty eight percent eighty eight of them got passed look here that just goes to show you it is. It's hard to, it's crazy, you know, even compare them with the real pair. Oh man, it's a real disappointing uh, uh, hit to the sneaker culture, the sneaker buying selling culture. Because you, you yeah. kind of gotta question everything now, you know what I'm saying? And you can't is Stock X the uh, most credible place bruh, to uh, bruh, 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 to get your sneakers now? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know, man. All right, guys, um, uh, transition in it. Let's yeah. just talk about four sneakers that Nikes dropped the ball on. For sure. But I wanted to reverse this one for the last one. Mm -hmm. We just saw these recently, uh, you know, get surface on the internet. I IG. Know. I know you're talking about. <sighs> I know. Go ahead and introduce it. What you're talking about, all right? The summer sale fogs that just surfaced the internet. Richie, we were talking about the other pair, the gray pair, saying the color blocking is perfect, but the materials weren't executed like the black pair. Yeah, let me grab them. Let me grab them. Right here. These, my friend, these, my friend, are gonna really make the shoe shoe of the year, in my opinion. So these are the original light bones, yep. okay? We didn't, obviously the color is super sick. Super sick. But we didn't like the material. Yes. The material makes it a little bit more bulkier. The creasing's crazy. Yep. But these new sales that uh, Jerry announced. Yeah. Dropping June 8th. June 8th, I believe. <laughs> They're made out of the same material the black ones are. The, 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 the neoprene mesh. Uh, then you got the new buck. It's basically the black pair. Yeah. But this colorway. It, I think it, it's a little bit lighter. It, 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 is, it is. It's more of a, on, a, on a cream side while this is more on the gray side. All right. Uh, those little details make a huge difference. These, my friend, are oh. the opposite of dropping the ball. These <laughs> came through in the clutch. No, like, I like how they're dropping next week. You yeah. don't got to think about yeah. them for months and yeah. months. Oh, you know what I'm okay, saying? Like, okay, I was okay, like, okay. when are these? He had, these, he, had these, he had these in his arsenal. They drop tomorrow. 
That's crazy. Tomorrow, this right here is gonna be the perfect summer shoe. You could wear it with Vibes. black denim. You could wear it with mid-color denim. Vibes. You could wear it with light distressed denim. Vibes. The shoe itself is gonna make your outfit. This shoe right here, 14 pairs minimum. And I say that a lot, and 90, 99% of the time I don't come through. <laughs> Rich. We copping these. These are dope, man. We copping these right here. I think resale price is gonna be around like 550, 600, maybe hey, 600. Anything less than these and the black ones, I'm, I'm, I'm happy. What do you guys think about these, man? Did you guys like these uh, sale Fear of God Nikes that uh, Jerry Fire. recently debuted? Fire. Fire. Like we thought, you know, he he didn't come through with the green. I, I ended up getting the green and the orange pair. The greens aren't bad. The greens aren't bad. The greens aren't bad. But these, my friend, <sighs> these Fire. lead the pack. These lead the pack. All right, guys, that pretty much wraps it up for the list on what Nike has dropped the ball on. Last sneaker being a reverse of dropping the ball. They came through in the clutch. Yes, sir. Anything you got to say, Tan? Man, I just hope that, you know, these shoes don't turn up, you know, being overly mass producer colorways. That's all I'm yeah, asking. Yeah, let me, let me. That's uh, the only way Nike will drop the ball. Hold on, hold on. We, we you know, we going to Vegas today. We got to play the, uh, we got to play that song again. Oh, man, do it. Anything else, man? Okay, we got, obviously, Richie Lee collection. Is oh, yeah. in the works. Oh yeah. You know, we are looking for we're gonna revamp in a way where we're either gonna drop huge collections or just you know give y'all execute every single piece and drop them, you know, sporadically yeah. or something like that. But Be on the we, got, we got stuff coming, man. Denim, like, let me post up a sample photo of the den denim. I was gonna say denim. Mm. The denim. This is a little sneak peek right here. You'll see it. Let me know what y'all think. Look, man. Perfect with the fear of God. SLP vibes, SLP. nudie vibes. We really did our homework on this one here, man. This one right here is gonna elevate the brand. It's gonna make it way better than ever. Yes, sir. Really excited. Please follow Richie Lee Collection for any updates, any drop information. Yep. But we're coming hard. We're coming yes, hard, man. All right. And then Monday, replica video. After that, uh, I just went to LA. We got a uh, LA vlog coming out yes, as sir. well. Yes, sir. So stay tuned. Make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel. When we hit that million, we are doing the craziest giveaway for a million. So make sure you guys hit that subscriber button to get us to for one million. Sure. I think we're like five or 6,000 away. Very been thinking about this for a while now so for sure uh, man a big right. huge giveaway is definitely well deserved yes sir for all y'all man all y'all for the support throughout the years yes sir it's been a cool ride it's been oh, a yeah. cool ride uh that's it hey, for it's just getting started oh yeah it's just getting it's started. just getting we started. got some crazy things in the works yes all right y'all we out peace i'll be there in a minute